Hauser. I came to Rarotonga 10 years ago to check out a population of humpback whales. I fell in love with the place. And you know, humpbacks are so acrobatic, they're so entertaining. You just fall in love with them the minute you see them. I feel very strongly in my research to do an excellent, excellent job because I want to make a difference fighting with science. I want to be able to take my papers and my data to the IWC meetings, to consortium meetings, to news broadcasters to say this is why we can't kill whales. This is why we can't kill especially the humpbacks that are now being proposed by the Japanese to be slaughtered this year. Uh, my name is Igor Geyer. I'm a marine mammologist. Uh, my job here in the uh, Cook Islands and uh, New Caledonia is to tag the whales. And for doing that, I've been training around uh, Green, uh, Greenland and Antarctica. So I got the knowledge on how to proceed to go close to the whales and do the tagging itself. It's really amazing to be on the side of the creatures and be able to put something on them that will help on the conservation. My name is Sakyo and I work for Greenpeace Japan. Last year, I had the opportunity to sail on the Esperanza to the Antarctic and see the Southern Ocean Whale Sanctuary with my own eyes. This year, the Japanese government will hunt more than 1,000 whales, including 50 humpback whales. Even though Japan is the only country which continues to hunt the whales in the Southern Ocean, the Japanese people really do not support this whaling in the Southern Ocean. I came here to join this exciting project, and I'd like to show this as an example of non-lethal research, which is opposite to what the Japanese government is doing. Now we can answer some of the questions that has been a mystery for so long, for centuries, since the whales were hunting. We know specifically, specifically where they breed and where they feed, but what do they do in between those areas. So satellite tagging is what is my part of the project and is that what I like most to study on the whales. By tagging the whales, I hope that we can find out a lot more about their migration, about the interchange between other islands, about the speed that they travel, um, whether they come together in groups and pods and travel together, whether they're solitary animals, how long it actually takes them to get back down to Antarctica, and where they go. It's insulting to think that a um, group of whalers might actually kill these humpbacks that come through here, the humpbacks that come here to mate and give birth, to kill the humpbacks that are born here. And so, not only are we saying this is a fragile population, but we are saying as a nation, you can't kill these whales. These whales belong to the Cook Islanders. They were born here. Mm -hmm.